Silana is a point road. Si cheka inda ola kono kwa ba fuetu la ba nenga wuti ba zuguti na abana wamanze pinwe ukona gaba the ugulza ba ba fanai last one kono kwa ngati bufu oyeto jenga manje sikle sai tenga la nena nzenga makfiga aspingere ba fuetu nzenga makfiga la ba abalo kuzana la ba gati le monta gati pakuguli. Sasha, <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> Hello, hello, Sunny Bonani, beautiful people. Sunny Bonani, welcome back uh, to Tenjua TV, where we have conversations about things that affect us, about things that are happening in our country. And uh, today we are talking about the schools reopening. Uh, uh, several publications have reported that from the 26th schools, which is tomorrow, 26 July, 2021, schools are getting ready to reopen. So teachers are gonna have to go back to school, get the schools ready for when the students come back, which in some places they say it's the 26th. And I've just read that some are the 2nd of uh, August. So yeah, schools are going to be opening and we do live in a rainbow nation. We live in a rainbow nation, South Africa. And being from Durban, I know that a lot of our kids go to school in areas that are outside the places where they live. They go to schools in Indian areas. South Africa is still segregated, uh, even though we have uh, our so-called freedom. Schools are definitely as segregated as the places where we live, because even someone who lives in Mthanga still says, I live with white people. We still have white areas, we have black areas, we have Indian areas and colored areas. And for most black or African parents who are working, they do their best to make sure that their kids get a better education. And in South Africa, better education means going to non-black schools. And also teachers uh, are also, uh, <sighs> teachers 
I also now teaching. I actually have family members who teach in Phoenix, and uh, they're going to have to go back to school. It's their job. It's their bread and butter. I know parents who have children who go to school in many areas, including Phoenix. I myself went to school in Phoenix in 19 Donza Metro, and this picture I used is actually a picture of my school, uh, not mid-secondary school, which is in Phoenix, that way I did my high school. I have many stories about it, some of uh, the stories I share when I do my live stand-up comedies, and sometimes people laugh thinking it's just a joke, but a lot of my jokes are based on reality. So, are you a parent? Are you a teacher? Are you a school goer? Are you a guardian to a school going child? Join the conversation, let us know what do you think, in particular with the children who will be going back to school in Phoenix. I will not be sharing everything that's been happening because I think by now every South African is aware of what's been happening. There's been enough uh, videos, voice notes, and uh, all that's been shared. Some of it makes you cry for seven days. Like you watch a video for a minute and you cry for seven days. So I think everyone is aware of what's happening in Phoenix. So schools are opening. I've always preached that we need to invest in having our own schools. It's been 27 years. Government has still neglected our schools. The school where I went in uh, Guamashu, all the schools I went to, I haven't seen any improvement. The only things I've seen is that now teachers at least drive cars. And unfortunately, in most uh, township schools, teachers are having to park in playgrounds where children are supposed to be playing. Because when they, those schools were built, they were not built with the thought of a black African teacher ever being able to buy a car. So there were no parking spaces in those schools. So teachers now that they are driving cars are parking in playgrounds, which is part of the reason a lot of children are being sent to schools outside their homes. A lot of them go in groups. They either travel by bus, by train, or by a madexi. Those hired cars, we call them is Motozoma Lume, uncle's cars, who pick them up and then from the township and send them to their respective schools. That is the reality of South Africa, that's the story of South Africa. Sometimes children as young as eight or seven are waking up at 4 a.m. so that they can make it to school on time. And they return home after dark, especially in winter, because if you are coming back after five or after six, you are gonna be traveling and getting home after dark. Some of them, when school finishes, they go and wait in local playgrounds to wait for their transport to come and pick them up. Ah. So here's the link, join the conversation. Tell me your thoughts, tell me your plans. Are you going back to school? Are your children going back to school? Do you feel safe? Are you a teacher? Are you going back to teach? And yeah, let me know what you think. Let's have a conversation. I think Zozo is a president of Pella. It's not safe for our kids, teachers, and malumes. And those of you who might be watching and you do not know, please just Google, because I am scared to say certain things in South Africa because I have not been working in the past year, so I, I do not have money for bail. Uh, so I will. But if you Google South Africa, Phoenix, or South African Indians, you will find out what's been happening in South Africa. There's enough information on the internet, but not on uh, our mainstream news. A lot of it is things that is a past. Actually, today, two of my friends who are brothers to my TV husband, Uste Kumalo, the Kumalo brothers, were buried. Uh, they had a big stadium burial because that's how much the community was touched. And one of the people that were chopped and bent in Phoenix when they were going to look for petrol. So yeah, let's talk about it.
Prince. Hello, Saubona, and welcome. Please unmute yourself, Prince. Um, how are you, uh, Sister Njo? I am good. I am good, Prince. You are welcome to speak in Mrs. Zulu, but if you can, then what's happening with the volume? Okay, I'm going to yourself. Can you, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you now. Okay. okay, I'm going to mute you, Mankuluma, and then when it's your turn, I'm going to mute myself. Uh, if you can speak in English, I would appreciate it, but you don't have to, you're not under pressure. If you can mix, it will also be appreciated. The reason is uh, we have these conversations, but we have them to ourselves. We want the other people to be able to hear what we're talking about. And also we want to welcome other Africans and other South Africans who are not Zulu speaking to be able to join these conversations so that we can learn from each other. And yeah, yes, Prince. Yes, my sister, how are you? No, I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. You know, Ish, mm, what you have just said right now, you know, it, it got me so much emotional with the Kumalo brothers who were banned uh, in this country. And I don't want to deviate from the issue that you you just raised here because I'm just I'm just looking as a person from the outside and and I'm I'm like if this thing is happening to our brothers, I'm talking about blood brothers, because right now, as, as we look into our country, we are still fighting for human rights, just a right to be human. We are not safe as black people. Black, people, black people's life has not yet mattered. And it seems like it doesn't matter because there's nothing that the government is doing about the issue, and we all know about it. And for me, as a person who's just speaking from the outside, maybe people will say, uh, this guy may be unintuktel or this guy maybe is angry but i was just trying to make a plea to each and everybody and say how about we as the youth of south africa we come together we make a statement to the government and we make it count and we, we don't do that uh, irresponsibly we do that irresponsibly so showing them that we are not fighting with them but there's a statement that we're trying to make that if we don't stand up as black people there's no one who's going to take us serious. We have not yet been taken serious for 27 years, remember. We have not yet been taken serious. Like the issue just that you just raised about uh, the schools that you, you used to, to attend in your community in Kwamashu. And you look at like 20 something years up until now, there's nothing that has, has been done, that nothing has been done by the government to improve the, 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 the I mean like the, the environment where, where students are learning. And it's not only about in improving the environment, also improving the way how we need to learn as South African. It's not about taking children to school to learn theory. I always say that people should not only learn theory, but also learn practicals. That thing must start from a very young age where someone needs to be taught how to do farming, how to do this. Because when you are young, things they sink in so early. Rather than when you are old, when you go to the mine and whatever, it's a, it's a difficult task because now you have to process the fact whatever that you studied from the university, you need to put it into work. Doesn't almost, doesn't always work. So my my issue here is uh, it's about um, uh, the children who are going back to school at this point, at this moment. And as parents, I do have a child, so I don't think this is the right time because how can they? they close us down as parents and they allow children to go to school. It doesn't make sense. We are old enough to can take care of ourselves. And those are young. They can't, they can't, they, 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 they don't, they, they can't take responsibility the way we do. So I'm challenging the government to if really, really what they are saying that this disease, it's deadly. I'm not saying that there's no disease. People shouldn't get me wrong. I'm saying that if this, this disease is deadly and we are dealing with a lot right now that is happening in the country, why then do you open the school? Which schools? Poor schools, deteriorated building, poor facilities, poor everything. Why then do you open those kind of schools? You know, I was, I was one of the people who, are, who, who were very angry when I realized that, okay, the 500 billion or 250 billion or whatever has been eaten without even improving the conditions of our school in South Africa. Because right now, if, if I can just tell you the truth, there are only 10 schools that I know myself that these schools are fit enough to can reopen. If you talk about Hilton, Michael House, those kind of schools, because those are white, 
people's schools and they are more ready they've got everything placed in order that they can open and continue with studying but if we look at the black community right now as i'm speaking they are not it's not safe at all to to to, to reopen schools so i'm trying to say to to to, to everybody who is a parent that they must uh, they must be caution they must have a caution ab about taking their children back to school because it's not going to be easy we might lose our children we might lose our children because of, of being ignorant and we need to challenge the government with the kind of decisions that they are taking uh, and that's why we need to be very serious about these things that you can't be closing us inside doors and you are opening children who are irresponsible about everything some of them they don't even wash they go to the toilet they don't even wash hands or whatever but what 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 kind of statement are you trying to, to, to prove to us. Are you saying that we are not responsible and children are more responsible than us? I think those are the questions that we need to raise to our government. Yeah, thank you so much, Prince. And then what do you say about the children who are going back to school in Phoenix? After the Phoenix? Uh, for, for me, uh, Sister Njiwe, I'm going to say this. Uh, in the Phoenix, it's a very sensitive issue and I'm going to touch on it also uh, as, a black, as, as a black child that i don't think at this point in time we were supposed to be sitting down here me and you talking about the racist that is being projected by the indian to the black i do not think and i never thought that 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 day will come where we have to be discussing this kind of issue because first of all we need to remind them this is our country we're living with you in harmony and in peace and you take that peace and you do what you throw it away and you started killing our people and you make us uncomfortable in our own country in our own continent and what the, the kind of uh, plea that i'm making is if you've got a child don't ever i think this like i said it has to be taken to the street let's do it the thing that is happening in phoenix and let's show the government that if you don't want to take resp responsibility about the lives of our children about the lives of our loved ones we're gonna we're gonna take it ourselves and take it to phoenix and show those people that we we're not gonna allow our children to go and study there while we know that the kind of people that are studying with, they don't want them. There is no way that you can uh, 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 hate the parents and love the children. It's not possible. If you hate my mother, I consider you uh, you also hate me, but because I come from there. So I, I don't I don't see any special treatment that can happen. I'm in India, they are pretending, they are pretending. And that, that needs to be told. Truth needs to be told. I know I'm not subjected. It's not every Indian, but most of them, they've got this, hate that is subjected to black people black people's attacks black people are this black people are this and that's why i'm saying that as people let's address this thing as a phoenix let us not ignore this thing because this thing can erupt like a volcano because we are just watching from the sideline and something is going to happen i just heard when i was reading the news i don't know how true it is that the government have sent defense force then the south african national defense force for what for what you see that in a state of Till the time when we were crying, there was no defense force that was sent into to, into defending us. But the time when we said, no, God, not, we want to fight them, then they are sending defense force. And I, I just think this is something that we as black people, we as uh, the youth of today, we need to think about it, that someone who is in power, someone who is in power there, this thing doesn't start here from the ground. Someone who is in power is the one who is ordering all these things to happen. Hence, for me, I am saying that we should not allow our children to go back to Phoenix up until this issue is not resolved because right now we still have mixed emotions and we are still very, very much emotionally. And we still want to deal with them, by the way. We still have to deal with them. If the government doesn't want to jump into this issue and then I am saying that we should not allow our children to go there. Thank you so much, Tenji. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Prince. Let me hear what other people are saying. Really appreciate your contribution. Thank you. Temba, hello. Temba, hello. Please unmute yourself. Temba, please unmute yourself. Oh, we lost Utemba. Let me take some of uh, the comments while we are waiting. Uh, while we are waiting for more people to join. Lamandia Azabulala is Ngane. 
Thank you for waiting. Kunja lonje sita iswe abahol. Ibo guys, please join the live. You can speak his zul. Hey, because the ningi the ning fail. Hey, when uzabosha we matel. Sita itu le manjo ba muti aika uzo padeje. And can I just ask that we are careful with the language we are using? We can express what we want to say without using foul language or language that is considered uh, as a language with an ism. Uh, well said, Prince. Guys, I have put the link. I saw some of you were asking uh, to join. Just press on the link and join. We are still living under apartheid as black people. Yo, you know, when I heard about the woman with a child who was given Nupriyane and she died and those uh, many, because it's more than 10 now, uh, people that were given food and then, oh, it broke my heart. I don't even want to lie. Makia, but so on. So on is changing, Jan. Yeah, how are you doing? I see corners, corners. Yeah. Putin, when I'm going to let go. Eish. As it is in the way, call it and the ones in Malakul. Um, Giabuga in the Benning Yalandele Lalenda by Mengizuma in the provincial government. Um, Bebe Sain Bamba Tanja in the by violence between Africans and Indians, even the numbers being reported, uh, the reporting. Uh, 22, but we've seen Amamoshar is coming forward reporting that there are about 500 plus uh, easy to mbu uh, as a phoenix as a bandaba miyama as corner that has not been identified. And now I don't know how the problem of opening school is and shooting when we're still on level four and the president has not addressed that we must reduce a level a country and adjust accordingly as per COVID-19 regulations, whether we are opening schools and whether we, we are even going further to level five or we are going below. Mm -hmm. uh, Inzima. Uh, inzima Gakulu. Uh, Tina Bandaba Miyama, we've been subject of media manipulation. We've been subject for so long of propaganda, especially with the former president, Jacob Zuma. I'm not boosting about the president, but I know I'm a product of who Jacob Zuma because he's the only president in South Africa who introduced a student financial aid scheme, which I was part of, and I've become a professional in my field, through that assistance. But without his intervention and from the presidents before him, uh, we will not be here. Many South Africans who are criticizing him, engineers and doctors, they are the products of him. But because he was uneducated and so on, uh, we've been manipulated and with him of all allegations that have not been proven. Um, I think East South Africa is is a playground for intelligent uh, powers that be who are manipulating us for personal gain and protecting the interest of countries, be London, be America, uh, and so on. Um, we have not attained our independence fully. And until we realize that and we put a stop and we craft our own democracy, I think we will be free. But over manje is not helping us. Because even Nokvula we in the midst of 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 the data various schools are being open, 
we are being exposed to more uh, infections. And the president Okona Ayiko into Aikulumayo, since he assumed office, is speaking about vaccine only. He's not speaking about people that are infected while having vaccinated. We know there's a news article about 59 um, nurses, Abase Island, and that are hospitalized because of COVID. Well, they've been vaccinated, but they still suffer from COVID. Truth of the matter is, I will say it's changing. Truth of the matter that is that majority of all South Africans who are being vaccinated are just subject to trials of AMA vaccines. Not only us as adults, but even our kids. Recently, I've been, I've, I've, I've cited of Fox News in, in US where parents uh, of white or European uh, ethnic uh, 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 culture are, are, are coming out now and saying, look, uh, we, have, we have our kids, 15-year-old kids and so on, have volunteered to Pfizer vaccines and Moderna vaccines. Um, and now there are, some are crippled um because of the side effects of the vaccines and so on i mean kids we know our kids in school in especially in and i'm not saying my school is not my previous school my former school is not complying i don't know but people are relaxed most of my um, Lendo a COVID nineteen Makaya. If you have seen people was Makaya wearing mask, it, 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 it's something marvel. In the actual legal, it's still new. It's not helping. I don't think the government even. Yes, Kumasa Pabs. Yes, Abantu ba ba um. They comply, some of them, but Emakaya, there's not that much that government has done to ensure compliance. We've seen about Emakaya volunteering to ensure that there's compliance, but what government have done, and now the reopening of school, uh, for me, this is my opinion. Yes, <laughs> but this is my opinion. The current government has invested so much with vaccine and buying AMA vaccine through African Union, OAU, and selling the vaccine to African countries. Uh, for me, this thing of vaccine is our profit gain than assisting people. And if vaccine, the current vaccines that we have if we are not cautious, it's gonna affect us in a long run. In a, in a long run, I mean. Uh, so we need to be cautious with opening of schools, with riots that have been happening. With they've been a deliberate intention for these riots to occur. Now, after the riots, there is opening of school. We need to be cautious as South African. If this is not a deliberate intent to increase the number of infections um, so that people can fear that there is COVID, can fear that COVID is killing. When there is that fear, people can rise to this experimental, and I state, and that is the fact, these are experimental vaccines that will have side effects to us as a society in the long run. Um, I think for us, we just need to, if we need to march, we need to put a stand, we need to government to account, to say, really government, what is going on? You are doing this, we don't understand. What you are doing is against the COVID regulations. Uh, we don't know what you are doing. Please account. I think we just need to, to put a stand as, as Africans or otherwise we, 
we're just exposing exposing ourselves to to more risk. I think it is also in our house is changing. Uh, yeah. Tokozan, Tokozan, Koko, Anguzo, I think your mic is um, is muted. Oh, yes, I've unmuted myself. Sorry about that. Thank you so much, Make, but Tokozan. thank you for your contribution. Tokozan, Koko, long time. Tokozan, Tokozan, long time, long time. Technology, traveling, everything. Now, manji, I've put on uh, without the video because then it streams better. Look, Tokozan, Tokozan, Makaya, Bonke, Abalalele, all those that are listening. Um, I greet you in love and light. I come with healing. Um, the past few, the past few months, actually, I'd say a few years, it's been rough. But we didn't see it as South Africans and as a country how badly this was bubbling under because some of the things were benefiting us. When we have the xenophobic attacks, it was benefiting us because we're saying we're unemployed because of the foreigners, right? There was crime because of the foreigners. We the, the 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 tumba had ruptured there, and we didn't see it. When everything in politics was happening, uh, we saw it in 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 light. I mean, the the other week, Shay was talking about this. I, I love Shay, by the way. She was talking about this saying, Wushuuti. If we look at the different administrations that we've had and the things that has happened, as South Africans, we are so quick to forget. When something looks nice and beautiful and rosy, we celebrate it. We don't look at umsuga wale zinto esizqakile manje. I'm not blaming abantu abansundu for ukuthi the Indian in Phoenix are behaving the way that they are behaving. It's 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 ridiculous. They they being hooligans. They barbaric lento bayenzayo. That's that's just being barbaric. Ubulwane bobulwane lento bayenzayo what the Indian people are doing are the ones that are attacking people in Phoenix. So we need to understand the South Africans. I've said this before and I know it upset a lot of people, but South Africans read Buffet. This has got a history from 1949. This happened in Durban in 1949, where Zulu people defended themselves against the racism of are my Indians that they were imposing on them. And then we look at back again, we look at how the Indian people got here. I'm not excusing their behavior, but these people have only been here for what, four or five generations, and that's it. They came here being promised. They came in, in what we'd call slave ships. They were promised uh, land and working in, in sugarcane farms and all of that. They got here only to find out what they're going to be enslaved. And they were the better off than us. So they saw themselves as better than us. And this has been a battle throughout, throughout, especially in the KZN area. So in 1949, when uh, Abanto Bangamazulu stood up against this racism, yes, they got to win that to, to prove themselves with Bonanla. You're not going to come here and tell us what to do. But you understand that since 1949, these people have been angry at us. And then Peggy Tele comes. Okay, I'm not going to use people's names. And then the minister comes and says, communities, protect yourself. A person who, has, who is holding a grudge, if they get an opportunity to, to attack those people that they've begrudged, what are they going to do? They're going to slay us like pigs in a slaughter. They're going to hurt us like pigs in a slaughter. But this thing all boils down to us not being able to unify as a people. I cannot stress this enough. For as long as we still don't say la le na le as a bantabansundu, guys, sio kichelo emakanda, kuchaiva emakanda, we to bashaye ama piano on our heads because we are not liberating ourselves. We are sitting in this victim state. Yes, minum lungu this. Yes, minu government this. Yes, minu India the pagamani ni muzum tundu. I'm sorry, it just it irks me up because abandabansunda ba fun pagam. Abandabansu by balegeli mwat. Abandabansu by balege look understand and by balegeli responsibility. How about you just take that responsibility 
towards yourself and say, who am I? Right now, we're being guinea pigs. See, I'm a secure la pen attending to go get vaccinated. For what? How many of Lababan who are vaccinated have actually asked, what is in this vaccination that you're giving me? Right now, they've caused this whole commotion, put uu Babu Zuma in, in front of it, try to blame, blame, blame. They were just moving us away from seeing what is going to happen. Laban to about 460 that were uh, uh, um, arrested, they were all put in a concentrated space. Today, no, yesterday, we got the report here with all of those people, Bebe Guleo, uh, holding area, Bonke, ba, Banjani, ba COVID positive. How do you go and pile people up in cells? Was good to outbreak, NG. I'm not saying excuse people for what they've done. I'm not saying looting is correct, but and if we're still going to sit, if we're still going to sit and wait for the government, if we're still going to protest to say we're taking notions to the government and we don't start acting for ourselves like the kings that lived before us did, if we don't take that power back, we need to heal ourselves and say, we are the queens and the kings of this earth. If I'm a king and a queen, no one's going to oppress me. No white man is going to oppress me. No government is going to oppress me. No Indian person is going to oppress me because I am the descendant of this earth, of this geographical area that I find myself in. So what am I going to do? I'm going to take my colony and When we go forward, we go forward in one voice and a constant voice, Nakon. We are now saying Black Lives Matter. Two years ago, we're killing foreigners. Lipi are you really true to yourself, Mundunzund? Black lives matter, but you kill other black people. But when they, when you get affected, now black lives matter. We need to go inside, but wait. Sio's claim, we need to heal. O government will not heal us. Umlung will not heal us. We need to heal ourselves. Forgive ourselves. Forgive, forgive, oh, koko betu, for thinking that they've enabled the belungut paspate ganji. Claim your power, Muzunzund. Nizanjemina nomlayas, walk police, walk vulis, isolomoya. I can vule isolomoya. We are very spiritual people. There are seven that we manage to say, Bella Pisia, Kulegas, Kulegala, but there are people out there preaching, yes, go kill Indians. How are we healing? Why aren't we protecting our children? Why aren't we going? Sonke, Jenga Bazali, Sisapotane, and go. And stay there and see what's going to happen. Are we going to be victims and run away from Lamande? So are we going to give in to it? Let's take each other and unify. You really want your children to go to those schools. Or start introducing programs. The extra Lake is value. Unfortunately, some of them have been burnt now. But Zonke Lake is value. Malukshin is value. Because some people don't have to be suburbs for what? Why is it as cupulitin? Vuga muzunzund, vuga muzunzundu. Yes, bas pete, bas pete. Kodamanji will be dying, falling like flies because of late trial vaccine. Nangit sama kini pig in sevum. So in gane tu as biele schooling on Monday. Tinas tin singa band. If nyempela u president uti agwenza gale loko. What are we going to do? Are we going to go to the union buildings? Are we going to do it there or are we going to accompany our children and stand unified as a people? See, Pume Jenga community, see, Hamben, see a phoenix. Basbone sees and we are coming in peace. Mama and Pella, they feel pressed. I and Pella, Babu Yele Magub. Aba Hamben, Babu Yele Magub. But that SANDF is supposed to be standing on our side because our children need to go in there. We cannot be stopped to going into places that we want to stop, that we want to go to. Because of what? Mere looting. Mere looting. So we must not get petrol. We must not get food. And our children must not get educated. Because what? Second Indian colony in Durban. I'm sorry, guys, that we, we cannot be allowing that. In Jalokok, the Infunajuklu listen to Lom lies. I talk about the Koko Sebonga Kulu. I beg I as Wagala now. I am enjoying to hear from different people on the platform. Uh, let me add our next. Person. Thank you so much, Koko Tokawaza. Uh, Sabel, Saubon.
Yeah, Mr. Abelo, please unmute yourself. You are muted. Please unmute yourself. Oh, there. Oh, so one, so one, so one, so one, so one, so one, so Nga Peter Sisi as the egg and two looking land delange in Columbusa Cola in land delays in the Zagala, La Pana, a phoenix. A Gubuasa Natiji into Kala a Ipembu, a silver dela, which is Libe Lona, Eli Pegelilla eating was a man of Miamalis Lashi. A old Tinagalanga manje Uguti. Singa band to spare with a general kettle zion, Jane Jobaks back for to what is for Tela Lippi came from over. Lila will only be still team be Luguti a Dios Vigela, Lios Mela, a Lisla Hill, Lisla Hill, Lisla Hill. Nyat Aban, Juti Bellendins or Enzega, a Phoenix, and so I teen Abandaba Miama. A Nabego Zagala, Nabas Trelle, Nema Chele, Guimanje, Conamanje. We are born out to a pegalapa or on his own baboshi, go to a pegging the way bushele or aiko. A mobile unga go to the bopumun to mopel go to te aikal. Mutu a pegal on the leo. A eatim jilgang is ill dial at least a leash. A nano would let democracy as it is now, one nineteen ninety four. It seems like we are no longer a, dem- a constitutional democracy here in this country. Maybe. Umeluti Igakurgas Tinaja Manda Basha Speguti Lipi Kumbelna was with this tatter this bag a la is funu good see a corner. But first, a Jaba Dama Miyama, we need to unite. In Yatabang and Jutina Langala Natina Madaba Miyama Spees, Inganze to the Savo Sunday School, a O Mama B to Amakuskas A to Nama girlfriend to Molis and Amathis de Ayaham by Emma Sundin. Ayo konza unkulu unkulu spizi siya shumayela on a Sunday. Na walu nyu shangu wati ezi nyu ntanga spizi zifundisa ama koska za zuguti kutuchula ganjani. Zifundisa ingan za zuguti kutuchula ganjani. E ipam. Seemingly, wala ababa figa nengkolo yu Christ. Ankolo wuti kwa bona baisa ila baila ndela lengkolo abafika na like a belu unganjini. Cause izi ndaba zinzayo. Zonga so, ipambe na luku e eh, wa aba abas fundi sa kona at the same time e eh, stibali so ingolo uchelu utu ngabulali tando 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 band ika kuna zje tu astand la band la band tu jamani jaba la super super life phoenix basu ale Asia umas ngati skulima ngalo kuzo tuwa racism kutuwa racism kutuwa e eh, E as as nga kulum ganja bushu tiongi de lungile ilunge umangabe i i e yenzwa it masem tia masen zinde tease kutwale on da ilungile kota ma yenzwa izi yin tanga ilungile na la abes pa votele baya hamba bayo supporta bona la bantu la buguti lenda ba yenzayo i right jena manje mutu ya buga i justice aiko e no mati na sang asis tatum tetu su 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 ipateletina nizatla zitu e siyo kwa lama chele kota buwa njia manju tuko nzakala ni phoenix angazi 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 kuti mangati siya siya ikala siya ikala siya ilumi siya kuti siya ikala api mwaba buwa siya ngati kukoko nke umto miyama otende zelegile sisiso singa ma victim sisiso wangi kona nji sisiso wangi victim mwaba asu kwa zikuwa nzalutu kwa zona lezi ipa mwaba ipeti lape mkwa kwa 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 Mina njo wangi mina njo mang 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 apply li la isi ti spam. Kuzo te tiskati. Uti ngi stow li spam. But bo na ngin li la ubo wangako na bonke la baba ntupa shomile. Ama mshope ba shomile. Ama ndia shomile. Ama nda wuse nkingi ni ti. Na inga nze tu si ambisa kusande isko si oti. Aifu ndo kshoni pimpilo mundu. Kota tina at the same time impilo yi ta shoni isho. Nklambe na tisi wiska si kuti inga nze tu si. Si tati si se la apana. Kuma training camp si si fundi suti kutuchulu wakanjan. Ngoba, ama po yisalawa na hulme nufa na wabia suwege la usi. E, ilo kwa jibi nga fisu kushu. But anyway, I'm promoting violence. Uh, we know if violence wukuta hiko, right? But, kune skati la wubona konuguti ya manju valelege koni. Lezi nde jenga, lezi zi zagalazi, ya zveze ila njuti kashle kashle. Tina jenga mandaba miya masimi ipikle lizo isi tele koko bitu. Kos, umo upea ngala okshala kola ba mshope. E, bonga bebe puma na ipa mei nkule ngagaze nyeze nyibon beti ba protecting da way up 
o ba la bang na zipa mo ba iti na bantu ba miyamesu na zipa mo mo ba tina ma po isa agwa zungene nda unzeta uta zota tipa mo ati pa mo as akfane le bantu ba bine pa mo mo funis pa mesi mte tuwe na kona food guzo chigele zisu chigele zisu na guzo wazo guzo tol zonge le zingi ntlanga ezi minority zona ishulme well ugwen zenge phoenix bagiti a a gwe ona into ngampela ngampela e ushula kalula uma abe abahulu betu benga ka pumeli obala nekeniso Baba ni kwenye sokti na jua bantu ba miam, e na le democracy si disna yo asa na yo, ngoba uma utu ya kuluma mshamba mjo ba kuluma nje, e nzobe sengende la nami kutoa nzo ba shusu sala nshu power la inpe ni ziti zinzaga la, but anyway, e kunono kuti si fasi si akona, but ni amanda ba sh, we must unite, ngoba se kumbi si lugo tila ba tila ba batala, abal katale le le lizwe. Futi ba yazi kuti whatever umuna galo wenza gala ujenga manje baso bebe nga seko in 10 years to come. Iti nezo bespegeni na yonke le mes e enze gala ujenga manje. Yenzo wa ibona la babandu. Mklampese wiskase kuti sibuge ama kembu a a hula amandu abash. Amandu abazo ba responsible for his intense enza gala. Not like la bandu a city basu 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 basu. Futi ya manje se tato ba alu kuti gale gale spandle a seko ndao. Fane le skale. Spege amanda bazo susesa pambi. Nyabo nga sistenji. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Vuga daki. Vuga mundo miyama. I hope. Sizo wazo kutola mando kutis bamba ne. Siye enda wene yote. Singa alisi sotwa. Ngoba that what divides us. And it's not kotwa kutik. The Lebabe figure net doctrine divide and rule. And if we allow mm. that new uh, happening, this will have some victims forever. Nyabonga Kul Sabelo. Nyabonga Kulu. Bisa. Hello and welcome. Uh, Bisa is having a bit of a problem. With a connection, but Sizomilinda Rangan, okay, Agunge Negi. So let us have Mshogobe. Sister Nji. Unjan. Nyapila Sizunjan. Ay, Nyapila Namakfan. Spila Kona. Siapila Siapan. Ningena Sang Sang Gube in the season. Ay, Kinking as Yas Velu, who is in the late the show. So, si azu sabanda ba ningwa so ezebe sempete in puti njengezo tuwa makaza ya shaya ya iganani. Ragia peta le South Africa. Yeah. Sister Nji, inde nzega AKZN it's very sad. I am originally from KZN. I was in KZN last week. I lost my mom so I went for a funeral. But to cut the long story short, inde nzega AKZN ibu shongo si stenji. And uh, it's an eye for an eye right now. This thing, uh, well, when it started, apparently it was uh, politically for a certain person. But what we've seen, Aiko Yonke Leon. And uh, I think right now I was just watching another video clip for another pastor. I forgot his name. Uh, trying to illustrate to what he uh, what he's seen and what uh, came to to his attention between the Africans and the, the Indian uh, nation as such. The issue as a phoenix is very very sad, and uh, I do not believe Uguti this is just at the end. Even though things are starting to be calmed down, but I do not believe Uguti uh, right now. This is just the beginning of the so-called civil war. I'm not promoting anything, but that's what I've seen in the sense. Because Abandu uh, Ababule, where apparently people were dumped uh, as Mobeni and wherever, people Abaziu would bango bani bago pi. It's so sad. It's so sad. And uh, People can say whatever they like. In the issue would yes, maybe even Africans were looting. But when you listen and uh, try to narrate the story, would is there any mall uh, very close by to the Phoenix area? Apparently, there is hardly nothing. 
So from what you are hearing, people who are stopped on the highway, I believe me, highway Ehamba around, uh, or that passes from, I think, Pavilion, I'm not quite sure, uh, going past that area, yes, Phoenix. So that's where these so-called uh, Indian counterparts uh, were, were, were stopping people mm-hmm. and shooting them. One guy uh, apparently is a taxi driver, Bega Trivelwa Munganwa Kelele Emo Twe ni Sistage eh, 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 Petrol. The driver eh, wakonu escaper. So this guy because he was sleeping in the car. He woke up surrounded by these Indian people and he was shot dead. If Shung a cool Indian Zega KZN at Epen, if Shung uh if Shung Sistangi, I can't even Say anything worse than what I'm saying. It was shown this stage. I do not know what he when there was one guy, by the way, and in Boni Legangane, we we video clip on uh, Facebook. It's a it's an Indian guy, uh, a break and uh, what he is, um, is protecting his uh territory. I don't know from who, and everyone Boni led that person probably, uh. The law enforcement can maybe come closer to him because yeah. it doesn't deserve to be where he is right now. Labando Lava Pradesha Ama Ama Firearms. A law enforcement is occupied with getting Ama Fridge and Ama Rice. So even by the time they get there, there's be safe quickly. So as no Baba Lab, there are so many people who Baba, who Dr. Muguni, who is. Uh, part of each channel he usually comes on Mondays uh, as a the same to talk some good in he was a victim of the Phoenix uh but she said him out yes being a driver you know it's made him fun to him for getting petrol yes the boy was able to escape got the motor by she's when it comes in the chat to a band to baba and be a directly autumn title even if the bamba one if my life is not in danger, in I, danger, yes. You think it will, but in a band of a semi chain, Mobabula band is in his pro pro. But what I'm going to talk up when you skip a Yes, it's changing. That's what I can't exactly understand because if you look at the police, they are fully armed, but they are not shooting with the live ammunition. To the people that were looting, to the people that were provoking the police, but they were not shot at. So, what about these people that are shot at with their hands up, surrendering to this Indian uh, community? Hmm. This is so sad. It's really so sad. Some of the people are working for these people at, at the Phoenix, but they were shot and then they were killed. I, I wonder what is going to happen. Schools are opening. There are some other kids. There was one lady apparently he bought a house there in Phoenix. Is working in one hospital. So this African lady, she had to take her kids to hide at work, to sleep at work with the kids because now she is an enemy with the neighbors because mm-hmm. she's an African and the, the neighbors are Indians. So what do we call that? It's so sad. It's so sad. It's a stage. It's so sad. And I hope South Africans, the blacks in particular, can understand what we are going through. And when I'm sure, Gobez, what advice do you have for those parents and those children who, or even including employees, who are supposed to be going back to school and going back to work, Econa Phoenix in particular? I cannot talk on or, or of someone's behalf, or, or I mean on someone's behalf, you know, because the pain that they are feeling is not the pain that I feel. If as much need- as I feel, if as much as I feel the pain, but I'm not on their shoes, because mm-hmm. the thing is, you know, people they might be using the emotions right now, and uh, you we cannot blame them because of what have uh, happened. Mm-hmm. But I mean, the, what I can maybe uh, say. Uguti, uh, let's try to unite. Let's try to make South Africa the the, the nation that used to be. Mm. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. And guys, uh, there is a comment that I need to reply to. Uh, um, 
Mike Lind, Uti South Africa is getting same vaccines that are being rolled out in Europe and North America uh, because in the Tengia Kuluma, Utiwe, Utenjiwe Ute, Bones is in Kalela. I will just give you proof. And I know I have nurses who are nurses abroad on this platform. I uh, would be happy if they can comment or people who live abroad. Are you getting the same vaccines that have been given to Africans? Basically, this photo, it is uh, not for distribution in US, Canada, or EU. This one is for Africa. Not for distribution in US, which is the United States, Canada, or European Union. So I don't know which one there is the same that is being given to the Africa you are talking about. But okay, we shall move on. Bongani Saubona? Yes, 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 Mkaya times two, how are you? You call us as well, yes. I know. Gilalela Bafuetula by Beginda. It's really a shame, it's a really sad time mm. in our country. Um, Singa Bazal and Jenat, you know, Sine Ingane, a funda of Phoenix, Baninga Ingan is funda Mandian, and they don't know what to do. Mm. Um, in young Aisha, then thinking as now a leadership, you know, it the only thing in Engens and Patega Bugakur Moba. Um, Gatignale attitude, you which I don't care, you know, we, we leadership um, for the fact that the only thing about beginning our manji because of a probably capitalism that is in their mind. I'm still against in the way looting, but the fact that there are people who died during this riot, during this uh, period of uh, protest, whatever we may call it. Um, the, the, the force or the, 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 the state will try and go to places like Chatsworth, Phoenix, and other areas which we haven't heard of. You know, um, yesterday, I was, not yesterday, actually, not so long ago, I was listening to Umam Kaula um, uh, from EFF, a uh, in the newsroom. A beggar isn't up, I born her because she's on the ground and... Um, broke my heart to listen for a, a, an old lady crying for the fact that she said in such a way that she, after a met, she wants to go and see a cancer link for herself. And the rest of the people that she, she has met, she met during the, um, that she knew what Zonka Lezi in Dao is, born to Mele by a wee Kuma cancer link because she saw some disturbing things and the, the, the brutality, you know, you know, when you defend, when you defend uh, your territory, there's no way you can ban a human being. If you defend your territory, there's no way you can look up a moon to and, and ban that person, whether it's a car and a human being, put it tie and everything else. You know, having said that, isn't there's Ning as Velile during this time? It's, a, it's so sad because as a black person, Kuno Mamo Kulumile are very powerful. Um, it, it is, you know, um, I, I felt that you know she's led by the spirit um, because she's speaking facts. You know, there's a lot of things as if Lilila. Spiritually, we are just divided nation. At the same time, we are the nation that need healing. Um, because we are talking about the racism, Yamandias, Kolumanga racism, Yavada, Abayabedunga racism, and racism and racism. But we, as black people, we are so divided. And uh, I think it's one thing that needs to be sorted out, you know, because if I remember very well, racism and, and this division of tribalism, let me use that word, tribalism is so vast as well among us, you know, to watch out. I realize I never noticed because most of the things have been ironed out, they've been just brushed on top of it. You know, the, this rainbow nation that came about, you know, you know, I'm proud of this flag behind me. But uh, 
this flag, you know, is supposed to be a flag that really unite the nation and bring that solidarity, but not a solidarity that is going to be a uh, whereby no healing has taken place among the society. You know, I remember at one point we were told by Nelson Mandela to go and throw Abu Kwash and Nepam and everything else about Taba in the early 90s. Because that was a sign of saying, you know what, guys, this is time to forget these things and move on. You know, yesterday I watched Sakina on SAPC speaking to the Indian, late, two Indian ladies and a, a one guy. It's so hard sometimes, you know, I'm a, I'm a someone who, who call I, I'm a Christian myself. It's so, it's quite, I find it really difficult, you know, to forgive someone who's not remorseful. Even Amapun, but they were not remorseful. In such a way that even if they find an opportunity, people like Abanjang would declare, when they find an opportunity to be asked certain questions regarding about apartheid, they come, they say, you know, Apartheid was there was there's nothing wrong about it. It was not against humanity. And those Indian ladies, which I, I, I saw yesterday, they were not remorseful. They said they were actually, you know, at, at some point we need just to forget, to forgive and forget, just like that. You know. Having said that, yes, I don't want us to have an eye for an eye. But at the same time, people they have to stand and stand against the leadership because they are the people that we are looking up to. The ANC that we put there, people, they, you know, when we're saying people shall govern, meaning we have the power to take someone up there and also to take someone up there down here. So we are, I think it's the time whereby people, they have to be on the street. But when you are on the street, you're not really doing what we, our people did last week. You're on the street like the, yesterday I saw a, a, a peaceful march, even though it didn't have that oomph or that power, but it was a, a correct way of doing our marches. You, should, you know better in the way we are here in Europe, how they do our marches in, in, the, in, in, in Europe, even though it can be like, you know, they, they, in France, you know, it can be really volatile you know, at some times, but there is, there, you know, you just go there and, and present what you, and then you have people who are going to push it to see it through, you know. But having said that, my biggest point is to unite. I'm praying for our people to unite. Tribalism must be destroyed completely for a mental state. We are to be in, in the nation that is united by this flag whereby we as black people, if we are unable to stand for ourselves as black people against anything that rises up against us, whether in the form of tribalism or whether in the form of racism or being marginalized, whatever it may be, that is not called for. But the united we are, is the way to go forward to defeat the enemy that come before us. Because if we are not doing so, we are going to be in trouble. Right now, we are talking about, you know, Ama vaccine and, and, and all that, you know, people like, see, you know, you know um, my brother there who just put a, a thing in there. And it does, sadly, you know, unfortunately, we come here and we ill informed about things that are happening around the world, unfortunately, but everyone does have a right to come here and then we'll learn from people who are going to, you know, you just call that person right now. You have called many people who might have the same mentality of thinking that whatever we are having there, you know, is the same as what the European or the Western are having. Unfortunately, it's not the case. You know, people have to wake up not being a slumber because we have a slumber. By the time you wake up, you'll be destroyed and completely gone. You know, unfortunately, we, we are we are to understand who are we, and unfortunately, they don't. Sabanda bang but if it's not tandana si sort, then it's going to be a serious serious problem. So that's what I'm praying for. That's what I'm asking. That 
you know, people, you know, whether you're in Guni or in Tsonga, or, you know, in Beti, let us unite against the enemy that is rising against us. You know, the, the, the enemy, you know, is there spiritually. Also, we need healing. We need healing. This country hasn't been healed. You know, the way I was, I was, I, I, I you know, since these things began, Bosha you know, instigated all these things. And then racism, and the see where Rainbow Nation, you know, Ella Ona was listening to the Gambongan game. He foresaw this. Not necessarily foresaw, it was something that was happening during that time. We knew it, you know. Those who are old enough, they will know very well. But better this thing, Zenzek, I listen to Jinlaman. Zenzek, I listen to Zenzek, you know. And we are the people who are suffering because the majority of the Indians are in Tepen, you know. So that song, yeah, this man, yeah, completely from SAPC, Coco Coz, and everything. But he was speaking the truth because the reason why they were trying to say because the song is, is dividing us. Okay, right. If that's the case, let's work it out how to unite us as people, how to unite us as people, you know. And I was saying that. The way I'm going to go last week, two weeks ago to the last week, when the anger of Mangalis, when I was on the screen, I was going to cool my team because I was angry. And I realized, which I have said, I haven't healed. Because this thing in Busele Peg, I have comrades that died. In Busele Peg, the struggles of the past, the things that we went through during the apartheid time. In and then I realized that I haven't healed and the healing spiritual is needed because physically I'm still stable. I'm still standing until this day, you know, but the special grace, I'm still here. Some people are still here, but people that went through so much. We as black people, we went through so much. United, it was not about the Zulus. It was not about the Tongas. Everyone, we suffered the same regime that we're, you know, that we're under. All of us were united to fight the system. We defeated, I don't know what I would say, we defeated or we partially went through to the system called freedom. But unfortunately, it's not the way I look at it. We are not democratic, really. Uh, the country that we are, South Africa is not democratic at all. If we school Muslim Jangaman in this way, because of the freedom of speech is in there. In Abbas or Yenza Mum called. Giza is there. They are trying to fund churches. It's a flat rate because what church is yet? I uh, told you, pay. All those things, you're asking yourself, why? Why people, Why they're chasing people who they feel they incited this violence? Why they're not going to the people that kill our people in Phoenix and other areas? They're not going for those people. They're going for Amara's Namatin staff. They come for all those things that they feel that the capitalist they enjoy, which is the things that Zago checkers now ban ban ban. Yes, it, it was wrong. It was not a good thing to do, but I don't think it's the agent. It's the agent because those things that come to destroy them as well. Sadly, people who stole these things, they did it because of hunger. Not all of them other they taken a uh, 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 opportunity to use this to do all the evil acts because even the people uh, the ama uh, uh, ATMs it, it was a college you know, na 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 which we condemn it you know but the united that's what I, we we have to pray for united as people that's what I'm crying for that our people let us unite and also ask in your in your closet just pray to the you know, for healing. Our people they haven't healed. And this thing, sadly, it's because it's a spiritual thing. It doesn't mean that because we were born in the 1960s, 70s, or 80s, when our cool and the apartheid, it's going to go generation to generation, sadly, if we don't heal. We need healing as people. If India, but we Gotta shy am am Africans since 2008. Year after year, we always shy am 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 Africans who are black as us. We are saying today, black loves matter. 
How can we able to say such utter such words if we were able to kill other blacks? So there's a problem there. That thing needs to be sorted out. We need healing in that area. We know mistakes that were done by the leaders when the transition took over 2004. For me, the borders was not supposed to be open at that time because we needed healing as people of South Africa first. At the same time, the education was going to be, things were going to have to change for the people, even at least 10 years or 15 years later, and then you open the borders. We are supposed to be beneficial of the freedom we fought for to start with 2004, but it didn't happen in that time. So that was the biggest mistake to open the borders because why I'm saying that, because we are fighting for crimes now with an African and we, fall, we felt that the, the Africans, there are more, there is, is targets for us to, to, you know, to fight with them because we're fighting for crimes. We are not really healed spiritually and mentally and physically for us to go to that level. Tina, if you get glasses, can be safunda, safunda. Sis pala lama pepper pink ila gusta la. I don't remember this pepper lama pepper sas pala ngao la. Our ma pepper gazu. You know, the education of you was I was absolutely rubbish. You know, it's funda bo form one, form two. If you remember very well. So and then you fulla ma pa water way. Ugzo banga ma crams. One jenga ma just sis sasa abanda sasa esa asu sata asu. You know, I listened to Jacob Zoom. Jacob Zoom, he, he, he said in one of the days, he, he was talking some time ago, he said, you know, Tinasi Kule si radical, or such a certain such radical. And then now, this transition came about, and we didn't know what to do because the only thing we knew is to fight. We have to go now to the enemy to teach us because we are taught by the, 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 the Soviet Union. This is where we learn to be radical. Amazon Jango Russia, Amazon Jango Cuba, Amazon and Jango Prista. We want to ice food, this this thing. And then now we have to come back and be taught by the West how to govern. Because this system is not suiting us. It's not our system to start with. So, but we have to adopt it and try and make it our own. And this is what we are still going through right now. So that was an error that was done by our leaders. But how can we correct it as people? So in this way, we need to just come together and be that unity and fight what is before us. That's what I just wanted to say. Tribalism must die in our society. Racism must die in our society. And we need healing as people. Thank you, sis. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you so much for drumming. Guys, I have just put the link again. Uh, what advice would you give Bongani to people who are supposed to be going back to work, to school, or send their children, or those who are guardians of children who go to school at Phoenix? Should they be sent? Um, yeah. I, 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 they... Young kid, go wam go buga wam janga manja. Unfortunately, young kid, ilere go government wait. O government wait, use kolomele already. Um, gilalele ela on um with with the um uh one of the offices is a wa kazet and we and see o o babumsheng o shabala la la. Eh, ebe kang because sometimes in this China just say like Europe, si buga ma videos, lalela ma clip, abantu the service and everything else, you know. So I have to make some calls. For instance, I, I did mention Ginengan, for now we to start ten, we found the Phoenix High, we found the Phoenix High, we babu akugu we say England. I have to communicate. So yes, yeah. So I have to communicate. Sorry. How safe do you feel for your child? Going back. So uh, the, the, that's why I'm trying to to go. Um, so so now because I'm in Angola, England, so I'm contact up and down. I said to them, "Give me the little u u u u mundo is cool. Maybe this is in front of the province. We better watch. And there's nothing. Eh eh eh. Who say if da 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 da? Right. I, I take that. And then I have to go and contact people who are near the families and everyone and everyone as the advice that I got. You know what? There's still another chance. Let this thing finish whenever it finishes. My son is not going to school on Monday. 
is not going to score anytime soon until everything is really sure, 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 sure. That is my, I'm talking about my own son. I don't know about others. Based on the fact that information from different people is still not really, really, really safe. You know, it's a big boy now. When you think about it, it's doing metric. Obvious, you know, as a father, so feeling, I didn't tell him feeling I give and say give to because I got in Kabang, that thing should just who and Saka and Abel Fanga Moki, some middle school in Bon, which Kambaranja, which how safe is his give on enemy. But you get the way about the corner, I got the right, you know, Gilanum Mam Kaul, Mam Kaul, because people are they're angry, people are not, you know. So my advice, people about assess the situation, and it totally they mean things doesn't look good as much as the government because government when I call me and I call myself and we're going to listen for me only God knows what he's going to say because I haven't heard him saying anything for the past you know uh, uh week two weeks the only thing the only thing the inside some serious you know violence really you know you know all these things are very cool so so my advice is to assess the situation when I was here Obona, Abanda Babona, La Peca, which in Gan is safe in a better to go to Chatsworth, to Phoenix, Newlands, or all the other places, very lame and so on and so forth. So, my own son is not going to school based on the information I, I did find on the ground because you have to, if you go to the ground, you can't listen, you, you know, um, to Abanda Aba Le Pezo Rabanga Tinde Kakul. You have to listen to people on the ground because they see better than those who are. On top, so that is my only advice. If I want to assess the situation, don't go to this And lama video, amanya ko na ngempela ayasabis because you literally see things yeah. pop like wood, and uh, yeah. they being bent like inyama ya se hamas telinga wood. Waba waba pray waba nku kamuin. And who are taking the videos? And me na umkwashineng na for all of us. Is when are we going to start respecting ourselves enough to respect our own teachers to be willing to pay the same money that we pay in the so-called uh, multiracial schools in our own township so that we can pay our teachers uh, recent, uh, decent money and make sure we build schools that are decent for them where they can provide good education. Because when you look at black schools, even if you are a good teacher, there are no facilities for you to yeah. even sell. So we need to really look into investing. People, Lababa, Lama Milioni, especially Lababa Shoy Utuzuma made them millionaires. When are they going to come together and put some money together instead of buying yeah. 2,000 rand in a Malu or 200,000 rand and drinking a ma champagne and open our own private schools even? Yes, yes. We yeah. children who want hire our experienced and good teachers and control what our, teach our children are learning. I look. Sometimes even at uh, children whose parents are Shembe, leaders and churchgoers. And I ask myself, why is Ushembe such a big uh, church? But they don't even have one of their schools. Muslims have their yes. own schools. Jewish people have their own schools. Why can't we have our own schools? Why can't yeah. we do that? Why can't we believe in ourselves enough? I'll just be like, "Who you in to get to sell lotta and take that other city, sell it and donate to a school." Like, let us just invest in ourselves, believe in ourselves, and support our own. Then we won't have this problem. Because I can understand why people are taking their children to the other communities for education. It's for better opportunities. It's for 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 better chances. Yeah. So, <laughs> Unity, is unity, and and and, and, and and we have a lot of graduates who are sitting unemployed. I'm back to number alcoholics because they're yes. sitting unemployed. Why can't you use those people to open our own private schools? We play don't is la lelugo tenga la pa emandiye nuku dagwa gongo December zobola before January. Si la lela ugo tengu chwala si la lelu tengi mswing. Why can't we say you know what? Not December eki na neko yili Christmas. We start with buy land. We build our own schools because we, we, we clearly cannot 
go on waiting for the government. We've been uh, made to believe that we will only survive among the people. That's why I'm able to pray. Because yes. when are we going to get together and build our own things, create our own things? We are good at creating shippings. We have one of the best yeah. shippings in Shisanyamas. Why can't we put the same effort in, in building schools? We are even good at building churches. Where and we love handouts, aren't we? And Uma Mumfundi, mm. we will tell you, Uti, pray. Type amen, God will give you a car. But when 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 they want it, they tell you to donate. Yeah, so we yeah. Need to unlearn a lot of things that we were taught, and we need yes. to realize because if any black South Africans decided for a week as clean and our Zabelungu, as the Sebenza and our Zabelungu, and we are willing to sacrifice Silambe for Inganze. You will see how dirty they are because they can't even clean their own homes. Yes. Even yes. So when are we gonna believe in ourselves enough? When are we gonna treat our maids good enough for them to think why after 27 years of democracy won't come to see a why are we still Africans who are saying yeah, that mentality with us? Mm. Not for us, for the children we are gonna leave, because our parents left us with the same fight Imagine our children 27 years later again, starting from now, we'll be having the same problems because yeah. and yeah. with generational wealth, with isn't mm. it? Why can't we do that? And I hope I hope everyone learned Uguti Ila Uputuluako. Yekanu Kamben Kangel. Mafila ba schooling alo, schooling alo. You put lack of course and let my hand out, my hand out. Let my hand out. Mm. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Nice. There we go. Yeah. Let's us stand together. Let us. Let's stand together. Yeah. Ah. I it it it's sad like it. I feel sorry for the children who are gonna be going to school and I don't know. Yeah, yeah it's it's, it's okay. tough, you know. Yeah, it's tough. But uh, thank you so you know, much. It's possible. Thank yeah. You. Thanks, thank you. Sis. Yeah, sure. Ah, yeah. So we, we, we guys, we, we need to unite. We need to believe in ourselves. We need to love ourselves. Because if you love yourself, you will love anybody who looks like you. We are the only people in the whole world who work hard so that we can look like other races. We're the only ones that put on hair that is hair from another race. We are the only ones that bleach our skin so that we can have the same skin color as other races. We are the only ones that insist on Ugnoma uh, Bantu just because it's Ukulmanga to Aselanda and Ukulmanga to Mulu. And we never question Abelunga Bazadere Africa. Yin by Dom Labanoma when the Ganjo Benga was Kulumis Zulu and Escos and Esu to go to Bakulis or Mama Bakuluma Laoma languages. Like they, there's something wrong in our engineering that we need to change. And we are the majority. Tina Imaliatu, if us not a Sitenga Tina, but then it doesn't work because manga benitin zo tenga tenji only to find utu tenji wei no hambile wa yo tenge belungu nome mandi ente ya bu zo ndaisela nge triple the price so we need to manufacture isn't ozeit we need to make our own things we need to angazi nje ku ningi there is so much and i i i nge sabela bantu anabed because oh if you have seen those videos Umundo Wazuwenza Leando is capable of doing anything. And I am also scared of the day a man to decide who will open cell. Bafit in Anze Tema Classin. Angaz mean I lent good funnel ends and Jan. Put a missing Jan, I sat in Gumfandas. 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 I sat in Gumfandas
because it, it, it's really, really bad it, it, what we are going through as as a country. It, it's, it's really, really bad, guys. And I hope we can just at least use this time to realize what we need to come together. And we need uh, to, someone spoke about peaceful protest and they were protesting in Cape Town. Actually, let me play this video for you so that you can see what you can express your views without having to be violent. <laughs> My choice. 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 My how to do things without destroying things, uh, without destroying ourselves. Poverty is painful. Poverty is violent. People who have nothing to lose are extremely dangerous. I was the future is too bright. Uh, I was trying to upala ilen tende. This is Ibit. so I couldn't know. Yeah, yeah. So I just wrote by mistake to attend you. Umo to get that hello. Okay. On your, on your Facebook, umo. Yeah. Na na babuge le basi 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 bakaya around that time. You said nanda. Actually, I'm calling. Yeah. Ah, when you say when 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 is that to Sisami Naba Naba put no Sisaba corner? Listen to another thing that you're doing around you. I want to visit him, and a few people I know that are visiting him. They are in general visiting him. Um, then Ghana put a thing between it. Now and Ghana, my other name is the thing. So, Dinali challenge of Ezuma when Ganyam is seven the Tinder from this corner. Kuga Jena, eh, in Tata in Momo Zogoti, Milang is a tribe and you can see the Halo and as Zobonaga, but in Zobona Monday. Six days military, uh, corner to corner. Hm. Yeah, bon. I think so. I can't finish imagine and can imagine the motel. Hm. Uh, Monday. Not if it's on Sunday night, yeah. Monday, mean uh, during the day, around two, I was in Phoenix. Then, I run out to, I run out to exchange Uber Utum San Makai. Tuma San Makai, you know, Namula Uzio, Mela, what they were going on. And the Indian part of the number I run out to. Kushi Modu Aron to Aron O two is a it's a provincial road. Uh it's not a regular road, provincial. So Mupa Kumba. So it's a 
Bawa kona bada Bina kona mba 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 shopa buwa mba 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 Ekonopia It arba nchu Mdroot Bafunu gya go mash Ufuna ukshone ngase Pine Town But from Konopia you need to drive across this traffic light Kona mba mba Kona mba security Kote mba 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 and one of family member the touch in what I'm gonna with Facebook because one driver the same song Gabona with Facebook they torture the car from Monday Gabba for the other bubbles but right but my right for the car past nine Ponel and a four and a foot moon, check with it. Nimenenjile Milan driver from Mshanga Iregi Hambe Yongena Enanda So there's something called E0 Zero It's an app So Ngai Hekela Nami app Yami Zero So I knew what's happening All around Deben Which makes it hard to say Because it works like a duplex Duplex is like a two-way radio Walkie talkie talkie so, main driver, I mean, I'm using visual. I'm going to be in the water. 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 And now, I'm going to be in the water. I'm going to be in the water. It's half past ten. I'm going to be in the same room. I'm going to be in the village. Three two months from a two get to a hospital. Start a puma go ten go past twelve so. While I was there, a get to a hospital. Okay, doctor Zane, the high motorbike crash in the it to Julie in Phoenix. The high motorbike crash. The boy is easy to about they can talk about. It's easy to bring a phone we land there on social media. That cool because. I know Devin well. Tell me, that's the only side. Now we are going to go to the and go try to start again. So, as you can see, I have a poster on social network. It wasn't an infinity food. When I was talking about the Shire, it's a side of Devin North, and Oh, it's in Nandi, it's in it's in Nandi, 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 it's I don't carry a gun, I'm just having my own faith. The driver, it was around 11, I think, in Phoenix. Who drive a Phoenix Highway counting 15 banned cars? 15 banned cars in 2019. I'm going to go to the hospital. And I'm going to go to the hospital. I'm going to go to the They don't even know what was happening there. The war between African people and Indians is a love thing. It's a love thing. And the other day, you know, I'm just going to say, 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 so as in easy though, the sort of cover then they get open the kitchen shop. 
Aga bange ne uto tuto ba peli zi pa metule la kufinisa. Ba ye gulanda la mafut pase la banda ba watati ya ba wadi ya ba wadi. People bakate la banda. That's why I was happy to do this. Aba wa ye, aba nagele ndienza la la pa. Koza ma sosha zo hamba la pa. Kuzo kapa. Thank you. Thank <laughs> you. Uh, guys, I'm gonna drop the link for the last time. So if Ufisa Ugungena use the link, I am dropping it for the last time. For the last time. So please genani 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 isangole koli telipi lelipi le si abu tu tu ya lo pues pa lo pues si ya abakulo tisha si zaba sega we need to really think about ugwenzi ntoza. Uh, well, I got vaccinated and I have no shame about it. Sounding so woke in the middle of the pandemic won't help. Uh, I don't think uh, refusing to do it is being woke. It's just making your own decision. Uh, just because you don't agree with some of the things that my authorities doesn't necessarily mean you are woke. Now, me, I vaccinated i got the e e e e e e vaccine i've had my two shots uh, but i would never think anyone who doesn't want to do it is doing anything wrong just like i would never think anyone who's doing it is doing anything wrong you're just taking a risk with your body because it's not even a hidden thing uguti am a trials that there's no lie there we come on up sia jelwa kupaliwe so some people don't want to, and we've had a lot of problems. And nama allergies, man, man. So uh, I don't think we should put pressure on Bandabati about job. We will stop. Hey, I'm done. We will go home. I'm done. I mean, Sazo Shuba, Mama Tenji, we mean I'm sorry. Phoenix, but since we have been going, but we are born a man, dear. And as if I'm a big and as on my security, but we are born Uti Uzili was Uzoli was soon. Yavuli country Uzozo Uketa Nikekelom Shat and Nikoli Nikekelom Shat. Yeah, guys, we had such a beautiful childhood. Sikula. Ah, uh, one genu mam sholos. <laughs> Yeah, ninja understand you. I will see a pill, I see a pill. See, 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 humble now. Oh, Banja, right now, I don't mm. think any of us can say all right emotionally. I, I spill in mm. well, like a second ago, my mom was advising me, Guti, Gikulum is in there as a right, and not to mention anyone's name. <laughs> Yo. A angen gibe mutega kulu si senji wengi zobega nje ama fushane ebese nge ahoka ngaze nkupugelo moya. Yeb. Yeah. E, I ishu ya se Phoenix nukulo wekole iya ngtinta kakulu ngoba kono tatewe tomtala ono mtuana ufunda e, e Phoenix High. Mm. And e, it's sad because Umtuana ntema nkulmana last week, she was excited to be a schooling, not understanding enough uguti kwenza galani, uguti isimo situlega nga ganani. However, njenga manje, as the other lady had mentioned, uguti aseko iskati mistingo, so uguti sibuele muva slogo skumba, uguti ubanobe neputa na nani. Ngobikle neso liche futiliti asina baba huli. Asina baba holi, futi enga bini kona kwa baba holi. Esa metemba ngogutabu mholi wetu aka nandaba. Pegogutara nandaba. Matupila wele nyilizu. 
la khona yonke into ihamba ngale ndlela yena fisa ngayo futhi yonke into eyenzakalayo iyamjablisa yena nabangani bakhe so i am not um condoning the looting and violence and everything but what i'm saying is when you have been umusukhohliswe for his catacid system jiwe when you begin to realize ukuthi yonke lento le ebe ngicelwa ngayo ngikhuliswa ngayo ngipheliswa ngayo ayikho ireaction yakho ezumuntu ivusa amanya ama emotions ngoba amasikhulu imiqiniso khona isishe sithi umufuna ukufihlela umuntu omnyama impumelelo ifake encwadini something like that bakhona abantu abamnyama bafundile kodwa nabo bekhona befundile sebe manipulatiwe i system ethenini bakhole lokuthi angebasakazi ukuthi batakele umuntu umuntu omnyama masikhulu imiqiniso indiya liyalitakule elinyingi indiya liyafika enkampanini mina nawe sisebenza lifike nokhazini ukhazini ifike namhlanje next week use manage mina nawe sisebenze in the same company for five years yinleyo mina ngi ngi ngisebenza ka transnet angikwazi ukuthi ngithathe ingane kamzala wami ekade yaqe diskol engiyaziyo ukuthi ihlakane phile ngithi ha uwozala engathi khonto ngayenza lapha ya angikwazi ngivele ngithi u ashem yinleyo what are we teaching our children what are we teaching ourselves like what are we equipping ourselves with yes we need prayer i won't lie Say ding you pray kodwa futhi siyadinga nokuvula nengqondo siye kuhlala phezulu kwezingqondo bakwethu sihlakani phile ngalokho esinako ngalokho esakushiye lokho kobethu sihlakani phile ngakho lokho ikhona esingasebenza ngakho ukuthi siqhubeke siyaphambili kubhlungu ngoba baninga abantu abalahlekelwe yimpilo abanye balahlekelwe abazali and nale incident yokuthi abantu banezwe ukudla bashona ankaze ngayibona ngishe yodwa NGO elide umuntu omnyama yedwa ame athi mina ngingi ngimelela ukuthi ngixhasa abantu abamnyama ayikho sithenje but ama ama NGO zi thina senziwe ilima ngoba sibekwa phambili ezi front line kodwa ngemuva uthola ukuthi iphethe umuntu omhlophe noma umakama ngesandla into efike ngicasule kakhulu ukuthi bayasihlungumeza futhi bayasicindezela ngoba bayazi ukuthi mangase basidedele singenza lukhulu khona le ntebe ngilo ngizo ithi ene na thina abantu abamnyama asikwazi ukuphatha thina abantu abamnyama masiniki wamathenda siyayiphuza imali siyaswenka yes that is true we we won't lie and we can't be lying to each other that is true umuntu omnyama me umnyama me wamniki ithanda ka 2 million uvela bona ukuthi athi ngisaphaze ngibe boza of which sengimele siqale manje sifunde ukuthi simanipulate bona ngale system yabo why can't we be fools not because we are fools but to make them believe that we are actually fools why can't we do to the enemy why can't we use what they give us in order to kill them silently we can do that we can do that bafetu aseke isikhathi ukuthi manje we need to heal we need to pray wara 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 u12 uzo shaya manje in 5 minutes i'm going to pray i'm not going to lie but in my prayer god in heaven knows and he sees these things and now it's time for god himself to defend us and not defend us when it only angaz when it what because sometimes i feel like he doesn't even defend us but yet he's there i'm not going to doubt his power but now isikhathi ukuthi umuntu omnyama asukume abe umuntu omnyama umuntu omnyama angazikhohlwa imvelaphi yakhe umuntu omnyama akhumbula ukuthi ubalulekile it's either umvenda umsuthu umcongwa umswati egcineni kosuku umnyama igazi elihamba emzimbeni wakho lilodwa futhi liyafana asibambisane sabantu abamnyama asingakhohlisani sabantu abamnyama asingabukelani phansi sabantu abamnyama kuphlungu sisenjwe ngoba abanye bethu nabaningi bethu bathi mina inganza amazi esikoleni ngoba ndi Phoenix wara 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 but khona abazothi hey thambe esikoleni umuntu omnyama lo 
and masa kwa nile vote umtom nyam la lela umtom nyam masa kwa nile vote huu ENC nje mina 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 hey guys ah uh, guys no man mele sibi ni kini so sabantu mele sibi ni kini so futi si itande si tandane in that way nothing can defeat us I'm telling you, you we are dreamers and we are a success walking. We are not hooligans as they portray us to be. We are not that. We are better than that. We are brighter than that. Our skin is dark, yes, but we are brighter than that. And we have bigger and brighter hearts and and, and more equipped minds. It's time for us to mend our country and go back or move forward into what we were actually created to be. So we said, so this is strange, but I'm going to miss this long, I'm going to get along. Oh, thank you so much, Mazuma. I'm going to tell you how 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 I'm going to tell you uh, and as law translator, if they're monitoring a platform, they have automatic translators. But never was very translating this. I'm sure you have to go and learn the translation. I'm gonna um pay onje. So they are definitely monitoring in this kulumanga. I got them translator. I'm gonna um pay onje. I'm gonna sing. I'm gonna be a translator. And then gonna OT. Sister, I want to send you a master's bo. Uh, disabled masters um, go Facebook masters is a way where you can support a channel but you can support me by subscribing to my YouTube channel and on YouTube there is a button that you can press which has a dollar sign where you can uh, donate or give any amount that you can afford to the channel to the platform but go Facebook by 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 Chile. So let us just, guys, je si bamba ane si beraiti sele utu minit ugutukubu twelve mazuma gei se bumelu tu tanda zewe to kusu nati si tanda tanda zagle platformu sele usi tanda zewe nzopu mu ala wakamsa kwa sele usi tanda zewe si ati la banda sis si ati la mshono Okay, um, Baba Kamenla Kong Kulon Kulono Mosa Cossiches, Nam Sanjis, Abu, and Moing Well, and isn't his use it is Sendayo, and isn't his use it is Coposicas in Moing Well, a sick Ella when Uncle Kulona Manda, Sibonga when a footing Kulon Kulon and Welling is in Pillow Jehovah, or Sandy Silla Moing Well, Labon Kulon Kulona Manda, Abala Sigle in Deniabo Jehovah. Ambala sige loba zal babu wanto na babu. But when you say ito lo nkulu nkulu ingwele, cover their hearts nkulu nkulu no musa with the blood of Jesus. Cover nkulu nkulu ingwele their minds, O Father, with your blood of Jesus. Cover them nkulu nkulu ingwele nge sandla sako somoya, nge sandla sako sezu, liz nge lo siza ku nkulu nkulu ingwele. Mas kita kite nkulu nkulu ingwele, tuze kwetu nkulu nkulu na mandla. Nge kulegele suze sabanta wa mnyama nkulu nkulu na mandla, nge kulegele kutula. Kulo mshabe spila kuna siti mighty father, almighty God. Ose mazulini nkulu nkulu ingwele. May your heavens, O Father, open the gates nkulu nkulu ingwele. May your glory be showered upon us. Mighty Father is the black nation nkulu nkulu ingwele. May you cover us nkulu nkulu ingwele and protect us and provide for our needs, mighty Father. Father, we pray that you may heal our hearts nkulu nkulu ingwele and instill peace and forgiveness. O Father, we thank you, almighty God, for your love and protection. In Jesus' Jesus mighty name. Amen. Yo, siya bonga kakulu. Thank you so much, Mazuma. And I also, I pray for everyone who attends the decision a right for ye na umde nwa ke na banda na ba ke ne sizo si miyama no guti squaz u guti slanga ne sibe united because if we all make one decision sizo ba stronger but if nami ngizo kwenzo kuti na umunye nzo kuti kwa sisi yazo kuti, aye kona makunda ni nakutala. Kufunye lwa nekutuwe nzo kwenzo ue, kube kona wenzo ue, fanga besenza nishupi. So, tanda zenje, and this has been a very heavy, it's been a very heavy life. 
Zabonga Mazuma, which was Valele Gate. And I'm just going to end it with a short video. It's Kumbuza, you could Kunja and Gambe Colin, you being a nazo in the lake, Colin, Umago Utai Buyeli, Ningabaza, it's a funny fund, the Are you ready? Please subscribe to my YouTube channel for more videos. Subscription is free. Mahala. You articulate something that's so important. Because when this thing started, it started almost like, you know, there was a tinge of tribalism. And there isn't such. I must make it clear there is no ethnicity in this. And our people, and as represented through, yes, the taxi associations, yes, our Zulu-speaking compatriots, we are all united against what is happening. So this notion, it's, a, it's, a, it's ethnic and so forth, it's out of the window. We are united, all of us, as the people of our country, and we are glad that we've got young people like you, Lux, who really represent the future. All the people that you're working with, you represent the future, and I'm glad to know that we are going to hand over this future to people like yourselves who are going to defend, yes, our economy, but also our democracy. So thank you very much for standing firm and doing what you are doing. And I know that you continue to run battles with these people. The security forces will be there to help and assist you. But this is real community engagement. The people of our country have never been united as they are now. United in their determination to say, this is not about us. This is not going to happen again. And we are going to continue defending our constitution. We're going to de continue defending our democracy. And we will defend our economy as well, and our livelihoods, and our lives. Because a number of people have died as a result of this, and we regret that. But we know that united we stand, and divided we fall. And you are part of that unity and that future. So I thank you, and uh, I know that the future is in good hands with young people like you. Thank you very much. Manju zojala ngati zostai sema kule nina leo ramaposa wako. Nina nizugufa, nizofa nani.